I must have food or water or something. Okay, so this is a cool looking ship. Or what's left of it. Is this the front uh, front or the back? I mean, this looks like engine pods. I'm going to say the seat facing this way, this means the front. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to Let's Play Planet Crafter. I'm Sunford Duskini, and as I'm running around picking up iron, I've just been back to the old shuttle pod and picked up the stuff over by that pod. And I'm coming back this way just because I've realized I can steal those um, and deconstruct them, which is a piece of iron, which is all very useful. So, other than that, I haven't found more food, which is somewhat concerning, because while water goes down quicker than food, yeah, food, I have no way of replenishing it. At the moment, water I can replenish, food, not so much. So, this um, is starting to be a little concerning from that point of view. Got a bunch of iron here. So we're loaded up with iron. We've got oop, that's magnesium. Silicon. Be nice if it's sorted in your inventory. That's one thing that would be nice. There doesn't seem to be an inventory sort button. Unless that sorts for you, I don't know. Perhaps I perhaps I'm misunderstanding that. But yeah, we are Oh, that was actually a waste. That was stupid. That was stupid, sir. Right, so... Ultimately, food grower is here. Now, we need more oxygen, but for that, we'd need more of these plant things. But I don't have more plant things. So, I think today, the plan is going to be to explore and see if I can get more plant things and possibly more food. So I'm going to take these oxygens and this water and we're going to head either there or there. Let's head over here. This one seems closer. So we're going to scout out and see whether or not going to this crash ship is worth it. I'm seeing all this iron and I want to grab it. I mean I've got a bunch of iron already but I want to see if I can get food or water. I was kind of ignoring food or water early on, but now I feel like I'm desperate. I must have food or water or something. Okay, so this is a cool looking ship. Or what's left of it. Is this the front uh, front or the back? I mean, this looks like engine pods. I'm gonna say the seat facing this way, this means the front. Um. Okay, apparently the magnesium has been grow growing inside the ship. Okay. It is dark in here. But there are storage pods, okay. Okay, more oxygen and food. Uh, I can deconstruct that, yeah? I get iron. Excellent. And... What do we got? Okay, what's the difference? This one does more oxygen, okay? Good to know. Let's uh, grab that iron as well. And let's grab that iron. And we're about to run out of oxygen in a moment. Wow, this is kind of... Grab that as well. And maybe I can get... I see a heater back there. Some description. I don't... Uh, I've, I've not got the inventory for it. Um, here, give me the, that oxygen. Yeah, I'm guessing I could actually get in. Yeah, if I come over in a minute, I can grab this heater because I can deconstruct it. Ooh, ooh, what's this? A blueprint microchip. Okay, color me interested. More iridium, another one of these, squash seeds, and uranium and super alloy. Okay. Okay, this seems interesting. It seems like I can I can make this work. If I can get out of here alive. Right, how do, oh God, how do we get back out of here? There you go. 
and then you know my base I'm barely anywhere away from my base and my inventory is already full I need to unlock better inventory I need to unlock all the things okay so back to base let's start off with our interface can we decode our microchip yes what did that give us agility boots how do you make those we need fabric we don't have fabric but we need aluminium we have aluminium in fact we're building up our supply of aluminium in fact we're pretty full on iron which is kind of shocking I almost want to build another iron storage here because iron is something we use a lot of so let's um have iron too okay that was caps lock caps lock nightmare iron too better okay excellent all right let's drop that in there however how do i i need to make more veg tube so iron i need some ice before we go back i'm making another couple of veg tubes because food is locked behind o2 from what i can see so food being locked behind o2 and we'll make ourselves another oxygen to make up for the one we used let's just um, as that's so close we'll grab that But yeah, food is, is, is gate kept behind that, so it seems to me that we need to to push oxygen, if nothing else, at the moment. Because while I'm not starving to death yet, I've only got well, I got a couple of food packets left here now, but I'm not exactly I haven't got a wealth of food. Okay, iron, that's not a problem. Let's have that. And a veg tube. Can I squeeze one in here, please? I can. Yes. Excellent. Let's have that one in there. And can I have another one? Magnesium. Come on, squeeze in. Yes. Perfect. That's how we squeeze in. And that goes in there. So oxygen. That should be plenty of oxygen. How are we doing on power? Power is okay. We've got three veg tubes. Our oxygen should now be pushing along much better. Which hopefully will start to unlock these. One part per trillion is an indoor ladder. 1.85 parts per trillion is a second heat generator. Oxygen tank three. What I need is the food grower, and that is at 12 parts per trillion. Holy crap. How many parts per, per trillion have I got at the moment? Like 0 0.6 parts per... What's that? Quadrillion? I don't know. That, that looks painful. Solar power. Okay. Oh, that generates quite a bit of power. That's good to know. Uh, right, can we have another oxygen, please? For our next outing. Let's put the titanium away. Uh, we'll put the ice in here for the minute. Because I'm going to drink one of... Oh, no, I'm going to drink that. Actually, I'll take those two ice and I'll convert those into the at least. At least then I've got them. And the cobalt. We're going to stick it away. There we go. Right. I think we're ready to head back over and pick up the, re the rest of the bits. But if we've got to make that much oxygen, that seems insane. I mean, I mean, obviously, like, here it's 20% of the atmosphere, so 
parts per million is like massive. Um, and I mean, of course, we've got a couple of plants doing a whole planet here. So I can sort of see where it's coming from. But that doesn't make it any better or any less like I'm about to starve to death. Right, radioactive. Wonderful. I'm sure it'll be fine. Right, let's get here. And let's deconstruct you. You seem useful. And let's also take this one. And take... Oh, I can take everything in there, but I can't take everything in this one. I'm going to need to come back again. Oh, and the fabric. The fabric for the agility things. I need... But I need two. Um, let's take that for now. And then I'll build another oxygen thing because you know, I'm I can't help but be concerned about the food situation so I, I'm gonna be pushing oxygen I don't see I don't see any other way to do it but to really push the oxygen supply situation I mean I might as well oh inventory fill I say I might as well load up but I've already loaded up apparently so that leaves me just running back Okay, and we're home. Right. Question. I can't build the next level heater. So, taking it apart has given me those bits. How much power have I got? Not enough to really run any more heaters at the moment. But, I'm going to put another veg tube in here because, like I say, I want the oxygen. It is going up, you know. Right, sorry, the, ah, the actual, sorry, we've got 331 parts per quadrillion. And the rate at which it's increasing is by 0.75 quadrillion per second. Right. That makes sense. Sort of. Okay. So, I want to check the heaters out, but for that, but first I want solar panels. Cobalt, silicon, iron. So, we've got silicon. Let's dump the titanium. And now we have, we have aluminium. But we have uranium and super alloy, which I'm just going to chuck in here for the minute because I don't really have anywhere else for them to go. Same with uranium. So let's grab a bit more iron. So if I'm going to build a cup, I'm going to build a couple of solar panels. So let's take a couple of cobalt as well. Let's build a couple of solar panels out here. I don't quite know where. Where's the sun? Can't even tell. This place is so thick and horrible and there. How, how can I even tell where it is? Okay, let's... Uh... I don't know. Let's turn them that way sure why not that seems fine and that way wow getting these level is gonna suck okay don't look at it don't look at it it's fine it's fine okay so that will mean I can build a couple more heaters and if I can't build all the heaters indoors, it must be dang toasty in here. That's all I'm going to say. Right. Um, let's put the titanium away. We need the iridium. And what else do we need? Silicon. This one. Silicon and... Give me the iridium. Okay. So we'll chop those down as well because I'm assuming... Ooh, 
just out of interest. Do they do they work if I cross them over? They do. So, like, if I do that and get it, I mean, it's not quite perfect. But I was going to try and get it to look like, you know, they were working as a multiple here. You know, like inside each other, like, like that, maybe. Yeah, it doesn't quite work, does it? It clips, but it doesn't quite work. But that should boost the heat up. Now, this is going up. Great. So, heat is going. Oxygen is going. Pressure is... something. Okay. Uranium. We don't want uranium. We... I'm going to keep the water. And I'm going to grab two cobalt and make another oxygen. Even though I've only needed one oxygen every time I've been there, I don't want to go run run out. Because obviously that results in death. So I don't want to do that. That seems poorly planned. So, at the moment, we're 1.6 KTI, which I'm going to call terraforming index. But in fact, because it's got terraforming index directly above it. Ooh, veg tube two. So hang on a second. Veg tube two versus veg, veg tube one. I'm assuming more efficient. Is that true? Yes, it is. So the plant only has some effect. The unit has a base effect. And with the base plant, you get the base effect. When you have the plant, oh hello, when you have the plant, hello indeed, hello hello, hello hello, you might actually just be my saviour right here. Can I deconstruct the beds and get the fabric? No. We want the fabric. How do I get, th can I get through the door? No. Okay, let's go back around the other way. I didn't spot that before. I'm glad I spotted that. Right. Have I got, I bet I haven't got the space for the rest of this now. Not oh, deconstruct, yes, I don't really want to. I haven't got the space for the rest of this now, I'm going to have to come back again. Warning oxygen level low, okay, fine. And maybe I can drink that water. Maybe that way I can, what I can do is deconstruct, I can deconstruct and deconstruct. Oh, then I can just use that iron. Oh, that sounds that sounds awful. Oh, there's more up this way. I need no, no, that's the way. Okay, it's okay. That's okay. I'm just mildly lost inside the ship. It's fine. Okay, so I head back again, and now I could build God knows how many veg tubes. In fact, I probably have to start thinking about expanding the base again. What I'd actually like is I can put. A window in. Can I put a wall in or do I have to live like stupidly open plan? I want a wall. Can I have a wall? Uh, apparently not. Okay. It's a little bit disappointing. I was hoping to put like a wall in or something. Okay, so iron in the ironery, there we go, and aluminium in the aluminium ironery. Right, let's unlock this blueprint, let's decode the blueprint. That is new blueprint received, mining speed, T1. Okay, not sure what that does for us, but we're going to get it. Uh, Magnesium, aluminium, and what was the other one? Silicon. There we go. Let's make it. Done. Let's have it. I don't know what it does for us, but we're having it. What I'd really like is the agility things, because I'd love to be able to run faster. 
Right, so these are 150% multipliers. So, what does a T2 require? Two ice, two iron, and magnesium. What did that require? Iron magnesium. So that requires silicon and extra ice. Okay, that's doable. So I could feasibly upgrade all of these, one, two, three, four, and get another four. And that would hopefully solve the, the food issue pretty quickly. So let's grab ice. So ice, silicon is going to be some of the extra we need. We might as well grab magnesium if we run across it. And more ice, more silicon, more ice, more silicon. And I'm going to start off, so we'll grab my using, we're going to start off by making the ones I'm missing. And then upgrade the ones I've got. I'm assuming I can take them apart and... But how much power do they use, by the way? I should have oodles of spare power. 1.225. They are significantly more power hungry than what I'm using at the moment. I mean, I should have quite a bit of power, but they are significantly more power hungry. It's worth noting. We've got 11 odd power, so that's fine. Let's, um... Uh, let's dump that one. Grab that one. Grab the iron. And then we can start off. Let's have you. Can you fit in this gap? Yes, you can. There we go. Perfect. Right. Veg tube. Have fun. Uh, next. I, ooh, you should not be in there. You should be in there with those. And we don't have the ice, do we? No, we don't. Okay. Let's uh, ditch the Maggie. And I'm going to put the ice in there for now as well. Just so I can load up. And I'm going to put those in there with that seed and the fabric just temporarily while I go out and get more because we need silicon, we need a bunch of ice, absolutely loads of freaking ice. Iron, silicon. I have a stupid question, which maybe people in the comments might actually know the answer to. Um, and I'm going to assume the answer to this is yes. But if I get the oxygen level on this planet high enough, I'm going to assume I can breathe. That doesn't sound stupid to me. I mean, let me know if it is stupid, but I would assume, done right, one could actually breathe. Because, why not? You know what I'd also like to be able to do? Is make a drill. Backpack level 3. Ooh, finally, so we've, we've reached one part per trillion. We've reached one part per trillion. So that is a good good shout. And backpack has increased. That could be handy in its own right. Aluminium titanium. Okay, we'll do that in just a moment. Ooh, that's not very tidy, is it, Seb? Here we go, we'll get something in there in just a minute. Yep, you, in you go. Get growing. Yeah, that doesn't balance out very well. I hadn't noticed that. I might end up sticking one in here as well. we still got some ice, haven't we? Some ice, some iron, some silicon, some magnesium. We've gotten up. Let's stick you in there then. There you go. And you, yep, you're going in there. How are we doing on power still? We're still good. 
So let's grab aluminium, titanium. What else is it we needed? Nope, we're good. And back. Oh, but we still only got backpack level one. And we've had backpack level two this whole time. Oh, people will have been screaming at me in the comments about that one. Oh. Okay. Double upgrades. Think of it. Think of the happiness. Double upgrades. Now we have backpack level three. Ooh. Happy times. Okay. So. Uh, magnesium. Silicon. Another one. Go on. You, you, you're not going to go there, are you? Because you're not going to feel like you don't have the hype for it, aren't you? Yeah, and I'm going to squeeze you in there. It's going to look a bit funky, but I don't care. Alright. Okay. So you... Actually... You're the most powerful one, so you are going to stick in there. You are going there. I mean, look, we're nearly at two parts per trillion already. Okay, so we are we are cooking now on this. There we go. This just unlocked. Eater 2 unlocked. And I mean, 12 parts per trillion is a long way away. But nonetheless, so if we take these out now, I'm taking these out, and I'm gonna deconstruct that, um, that, that. I'm so gonna need to expand the base soon, aren't I? You can see this coming. Uh, I need some silicon. All right, let's squeeze that in there. Okay, you in. Yep. And you. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Love it. You go in there. And no, you need more ice. There we go. Got another ice here. Now I need to go out and get some more in a second. But it's not going to fit in that gap, is it? Not this time. Okay. So let's squeeze these either side of the door. There we go. So this should now be up to yeah 11. This is going some now. This is good. This is good. That's starting to really move. So what do I need? I need some ice and some silicon to make that. I could start going up to. I could start going up to a couple of T2s here as well because they generate a lot more heat. But I'm probably going to be running out of power by the time I get there. So let's go out and grab the extra. Oh man, I'm running out of water again, aren't I? Need to pick up some ice. There's a bunch of ice over here. The extra ice is not going to hurt if I pick up extra. Because I'm going to need the water. Ice me. Give me ice. Magnesium. Come on. Thank you. What we got here? Silicon. Sure. Iron. I'll take it. More iron, I'll take that too. More iron. Okay, we're gonna be grabbing a bunch of ice. Cobalt. Yeah, because hopefully we're pushing along fast enough now that I I'm hopeful we're not gonna run out of food now. Because we don't have a vast amount of food. But we're pushing up in numbers pretty rapidly. I mean, what's nice is I can actually see the dial ticking here on the 
KTI. I can actually see it ticking and it's ticking reasonably furiously, which is nice. So that's a positive feeling, if nothing else. Yeah, we need to make some water. Drink some water. Can I just drink some water? There we go. Right, let's um... Yeah, we are so going to need to expand this base. I've like crammed everything I can in here already. Okay, so what do I need to make some solar panels? I need to make some more solar panels. I need some more silicon. And I'm probably going to need at least another two. So let's get some silicon here. Uh, I'm going to grab the iron. Hoping to find some to find some silicon along here as well though. Yeah, there's some silicon right here. You can grab this silicon. There we go. And yoink. Do -do 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 -do. Right, let's see. I can build at least one, I'm sure. So let's build another one. I still haven't quite figured out where the sun is yet, but uh, we'll build another one here. This is all going to be a bit higgledy piggledy, I'm afraid. Let's try not to build it behind a rock, at least. That'll make me feel slightly less terrible. There you go, oxygen tank three. That's good stuff. Oxygen tank three. Right, let's go back and sort that out. Right. I'm back in. I'm not sure I can fit one here. No, I was hoping to be able to fit another thing to, to squeeze ice in. Because I've got a lot of ice at the moment. Uh, I've got some iron there. But part of that is because I'm going to make a absolute raft of water. So I might as well just nail in the raft of water. There we go. Plenty of water there, and I'll just keep the two ice in here. Oh, there's no space for the two ice in there. Okay. Magnesium. Cobalt. Right, by the way, we can now make oxygen tank three. We need the magnesium I've just put away and aluminium. Okay, magnesium and aluminium. We definitely need to start finding some more aluminium in the not too distant future. And let's nail that one. Now we have more oxygen again. Excellent food. Let's eat that. And titanium, if you don't mind. And iron number two, you will chuck the, that in there as well. Because I, I haven't forgotten, I still need to go back to that ship and get the other bits that are there. But before I do that, I want to sort out these heaters and see if I can make like some T2 heaters here. Titanium aluminium. Ooh. Three maximum, I guess. Maybe not even that. Because going to be limited here. So what do we need? Yeah, we need two iridium for each one. So that is, mm, that's going to be rather limited. And come on, there you go, right there, yep, perfect. And we can build another one for sure. There we go. And maybe we can do the same with the pipes where you line it up here. Uh, that didn't really work the way I was hoping. And that's me out of Iridium. So, that's that. How are we doing on power? We're still good. Okay. But that should be accelerating the heat situation. Not as fast as anything else. However, we are rapidly flying along towards our 12 parts per, mi per million on the on the oxygen which makes me really happy because that means probably not gonna die 
yet. He says, yet being the operative word here. But yeah, these are producing a lot more heat. So it should be pushing that up. Right. Back to the ship. Okay, so back at the ship, we're grabbing this and cloth. Does that mean we've got two fabric now? I don't think so. I think I put that one in there because I didn't have enough. Because I want two fabric because that's what I want for the running leg things. Um, and I guess, I guess there's nothing else here. I guess that's it. Yeah? I guess I have now looted this ship out. There seems to be nothing else to find here. Oh, I know what I didn't do. I didn't take that. Hmm, that's a shame. I've looted this ship out. So now I have to go to probably that other wreck I can see and see if there's something else in there. Um, ooh, I spy with my little eye something beginning with box. Oh, and I should say, while I was on the way over here, the progress screen unlocked. So we'll be doing that as soon as we get back as well. Hello. I will take those. I will take your food. I don't have your thing. I want your oxygen. But I will take your food. Alright, let's grab all of these bits while we're here. We may as well grab the further away resources while we're further away. And I'm going to take aluminium because I don't see much of that around. I might now... No, have I got two uranium on me? No, just one. Not enough to build another heater. I could build a, like, stage one heater, which I might do. I might build the stage one heater. The other thing I'm picking up a lot of is iron, but that's good because I want to pick up iron actually, because we're going to need to expand our base again, because I just don't see us being able to carry on the way we are. We're running out of space. And I think we're going to end up expanding out quite, quite largely to try and expand out the base and actually make things keep going here. So let's just get this back in. And that's good. Right, linen fabric. I don't think I've got anything here. And another reason I'm gonna to need to expand the base is just to put down some more bloody storage boxes to put the stuff I haven't got space for in. Right. Is there a way to... This does... Oh, this does sort. This button does sort. Lovely. That's nice. That's a nice button. I like that button. That's good, because that makes putting away easier. Yeah, because that's full. And this is actually full of iron now. And... What, what, what was that? I, I missed what that said. I, I think that was water. Have water. I think that is what that was going for. Right, cobalt and... Okay. I think, yeah, I think it was trying to tell me I need more water. What I'm going for is expansion. And I'm thinking to go. Well, relative, relatively decent size expansion. So, want to be grabbing all this iron that's in here, and probably some of this too. And. We'll grab that water to stop it complaining. And yeah, we're gonna build out here. Build this way, there. Ooh, T2 solar. 
That was quick, actually, T2 solo. I think T2 solo is quite powerful. We get 19.5. Ooh, food grower. Food grower. Food grower. Wow. We got food grower pretty fast, actually. Bearing in mind how quick, how how long ago we only got um the one part per trillion. And now we're at 12 parts per trillion. So the focus there has really helped push things. A new blueprint received. Bacon. Ooh, bacon. Right. So how much iron have we got? Because what I would like to do is expand out probably all around. So probably need a couple more iron. We're going to take some titanium here. Two, three. I think that's enough. So my thought is I'm going to go one here. One here. If I can squeeze that on. One here. Yeah. And one here. And, yeah, thought I'd be like an iron short or something. Now we're going to be under pressure to pick iron up again. And one here. And there we go. Now we have some serious expansion on the cards. These are going to have to move, but that's okay. I shall just end up slapping them down in here a bit, somewhere. I mean, I wish some of these bits were easier to move, but... Never mind. It is what it is. What I might end up doing is just like putting a heater there so as so I can chuck the heater on the side, then move these around. So things like let's pick that up and grab that one, for example. And then because I feel like this area is now going to be permanent, what we'll do, you know, let's take that heater. Cannot deconstruct something inside. What do you mean something inside? There's nothing inside it. It's a bloody heater. Deconstruct the heater. Thank you. Right, so we we'll put the heater like back here. It sticks out a bit further than I'd like. But yes, stick the heater there. And then can put this will be cobalt and then this will be I know something else if I have the material so you're going to be cobalt again and we're gonna you be silicon let's just grab a couple of iron here because that will make my life easier because then I can go silicon and then what I'm thinking is maybe we'll can we tag it in like that? I think so. Silicon. Well correctly this time. And you are gonna part there. And I mean I'm not going to move the aluminium right now. No, what am I going to move? I was going to... Just... Think about putting something down like... Uranium or something like that, you see? Put that there. Actually, I might move that heater to there. And then I can... Think about maybe... I don't know. I'm, I'm fine with leaving the aluminium there though. So I could go like iridium. Iridium. There we go. And what's upsetting me is that that one is actually further forward. You know, it, it's, it's sadly upsetting me just a tiny little bit. That's okay. Right, better. Iridium. There we go. And that is 
um, like that, or is there another I? I never remember. So that's those. And then we can go Iridium, spelled correctly, thank you. Uranium, spelled correctly, aha! I have my moments. And you can be Fabric. I know I'm keeping you in for some organisation here, but that's going to be part of this game, I'm afraid. And there you go, fabric. And we can even consider super, super alloy. Alright. So this will be super alloy. And we can do that for the time being. Ice I'm gonna worry about less. New blueprint, double bed. I haven't even got a bed yet. Let alone a double bed. Right. So food. Food, 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 food. You, you are gonna get deconstructed, and you, I'm gonna try and squeeze you in here. Can I squeeze you in here? Oh, uh, hang on. Come on, you know you want to. Like that. Yeah? Perfect. Clip through the clip through the box, which sort of upsets me, but I'm gonna live with it. I'm gonna live with it for now. If I can move the boxes over later, I might do something with them. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not just saying that because it's not fine. It's fine. Right. Food. Aluminium, iron and water. Okay. Water. Right. How many food have I got? Three. So three water. Not enough iron. Crap. And aluminium three. Okay. Let me grab some iron because I want food. Feed me. Feed me. Right, I'm sure that's iron right there, which is why I'm beelining for it, and then I'm going to worry about other things in a minute. Right, food, 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 we are not going to starve to death, tell me. Right, okay. So, food. Oh, aluminium. One, two, three, there we go. And food come on food you can fit there right perfect can you fit in these gaps actually you could that's interesting you're not gonna fit in there are you um hmm. i mean because my temptation is can i can i stick it in here i mean i've asked that lots of times and been told no but you know You don't ask, you don't find out, no? Alright, um Right, one there. Uh-oh. That sounded poor. Not enough power. Balls. Okay. So with that, I'm gonna say thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe as always, and join us again next time when I think we're going to be making more power. Thanks a lot.